Okay, before anybody gives us a thumbs down, we'll do a quick introduction to the video. Our intent today was to go salmon fishing. We got absolutely no salmon, and we uh, had quite the interesting twist today, so stay tuned to the video. Good morning, everybody. It's 6 o'clock in the morning, uh, 13 degrees, hardly cloudy, about, I think it's about 53, 54 Fahrenheit, so heading salmon fishing. It's supposed to be about uh, 23, 24 degrees today, which is I think about mid 70s or so. Just to uh, show you kind of the effect that Lake Superior has on the weather around here, we're going about uh, I guess we're about 35 miles in a straight line across the lake from where we live on Lake Superior on the North Shore, and uh, where we're going today, it's going to be in the mid 70s, kind of a north wind. But at home, uh, just slightly away from the lake, it's supposed to be uh, about 34 degrees Celsius, which is probably in the low 90s so the lake has a huge effect on the weather around here hopefully the fishing is awesome today we'll see you on the lake We hooked onto something and it's 7.45, so we're a little bit earlier than last time, so it's almost like clockwork. We catch the first fish around the same time. Uh, today is July the 2nd, so um, a little bit later than, uh, I think we're about a week, week and a half after our last fishing trip here, so. How's it feel? Heavy. Heavy? Heavy. Did the dipsy pop on it? the camera down salmon fishing we're trolling almost uh, three miles an hour and we had that down 20 feet and we got I think one of the biggest walleyes I think I've ever seen I think that's the first time we've ever got a walleye out here uh, trolling for salmon that, let's take a quick measurement of that That was a kind of a surprise, eh? Well, we measured that uh, 
top walleye and was 28 inches. So I mean, for, that was kind of a surprise getting that to three miles an hour. So we're using these size one dipsies now too. So basically we're we're letting uh, only letting out 40 feet. We're going down about 20 feet. So. That almost catches another wally by the way it feels. We got another monster walleye here. Here, take the camera. I got it. Look at, look at this. Take. Oh. Hang on. Let's see if I can get this. Uh, where are the pliers? Yeah, I'll need it. Take a look at that for a fish. Here we are salmon fishing lake trout. And we've got another guy here. We'll get that guy back. Awesome. Okay, let's get a salmon here. So just to show on the GPS, I know we're, we're times an hour off, so it's actually 7.56, but we're in 193 feet of water. Dipsy, so, I mean, that, that's amazing that they're uh, cruising around in that depth. So obviously it goes to show you how much uh, bait fish there is. So, I mean, those uh, schools of bait fish that were going at 30 to 60 feet, I guess those big walleyes are just kind of feeding upon those. So it's kind of a little different in uh, the area where uh, we're, we're at right now in Superior, so. Let's see if we can get a salmon. Hmm. Time to do a lure change. I got uh, hooked onto one here. Actually, it's really close, so I'm going to put the camera down, and we'll get the net. Lake Lake trout. How uh, how far down did you have that one? I had the dipsy set twenty feet down. Twenty feet, eh? Huh. I mean, kind of funny. That's uh, we're doing almost three miles an hour. We're going downwind right now, and twenty feet water temps. 60, 61 degrees. We're, uh, so far, we've got everything except what we're looking for. We've got probably a half dozen walleyes that were probably some of the biggest walleyes I've ever caught. And uh, a couple nice lake trouts. Nice, nice little guy, hang on. Snap a quick picture. Awesome little fish. Alright. I'm caught. Oh. Took water over the front there. I think it's uh I think it's time to head home. It's getting a little windy there. We took uh took one wave right over the bow there a little bit, so uh, we'll sneak in here.
an interesting day to say the least. It's 11:30 right now, 11:40, and we're uh, got chased off the lake. The, the waves are probably getting fairly big. They're probably two to three feet. The wind was blowing straight out of the south. Again, uh, it's forecast to be out of the north and small waves. So the meteorologist was wrong again. Anyway, we had an awesome day. We're a little discouraged. I mean, we went out. Uh, the intent was to go salmon fishing, but got absolutely no salmon. We got probably six of the biggest walleye that we've ever caught before. They're all in the, the high uh, 20s, uh, 27, 20, 29 inches and probably well in excess of 10 pounds. So we got those uh, surprisingly on the dipsies and on the downriggers on spoons, um, like 20 to 30 feet down. So I don't think we've ever caught walleye quite like that before. Um, and it's kind of funny because if, if uh, we had gone walleye fishing and we caught one of those fish, we would have been ecstatic.